Hi, my name is Dawn and I work at the Saskatoon Public Library. My son Owen is here to help me today in our home on Treaty 6 land. Now we have always wanted to make a toy car wash, but have never had the time. And now with needing to spend more time in our home, we have lots of time and you may as well. So if you also make a car wash or a toy wash at your house, we want to see what you do. But this is how we're going to do ours today. We're going to take an empty milk jug that's been rinsed and we've already started cutting. We're gonna cut the bottom portion off the milk jug. And this is gonna be our main part of our car wash or toy wash. I was trying to tell Owen maybe he could wash some of his superheroes, but he assures me that they shower regularly. So we're only doing cars today. Oh, I made it a little crooked. Okay, we'll fix this. We'll make it a little straight. So when I'm done with the scissors, Owen is going to cut a little bit of sponge to go into <clears throat> the door of our car wash. So that's what it looks like so far. I already punctured two holes, which you'll see what they're for later. Next, I'm going to, should have brought, oh, I have bigger scissors. Owen, I'm gonna let you use these scissors and we cut a sponge. We only had one big sponge. So we're gonna cut little strips off this sponge. So Owen is gonna work on that. Well, I cut the doors for our car wash. And then, just to make sure that they're not sharp, we're gonna wrap a little bit of tape around the doorways because I think you're gonna be putting your hands in and out of the car wash. Just get those cars in and out. Right on. All right, so now we have the doors cut in our car wash. We're going to put a little bit of tape around. How are you doing with your cutting? Good. Good. It's coming along well. So this will just prevent anyone from cutting their fingers. We're rubbing on sharp edges as they're moving vehicles in and out of the car wash. This is a little tricky. That should work. All right. When you're done, Owen, we're going to um, put a little bit of tape on those and attach them into our doorways. Maybe our friends at home like going through the drive-through car washes as much as we do. Seeing all the different cool types of soap. There's some neat things that happen at the drive-through car wash. Mm -hmm. Car wash. Just car wash? It gets our car clean. That's a cool thing. All right, good job. You're all done? Okay, should we attach those into the door of our car wash then? Okay. Okay. I'm almost done taping this edge. Which is tiny. Pardon me? Just I did mine tiny. really tiny. It doesn't matter what size they are though. Do you want to cut up another sponge while I attach those to the door? So that we have enough to go on the front Could and the I back. Can I do these two at a time? Sure. If you want to. Do you think you can? Do you want to use the big scissors? Sure. If you're careful, those will cut a lot deeper. Oh, I can't find the front of my tape. All right. So we're just going to use the green tape. <laughs> It'll work well, too. Okay. So one made a nice pile of these and we're going to tape them into the door of our car wash. Just like that. Okay. Oh, we'll tape those to our other door. Okay. So that's what it looks like. I think that looks pretty great, Owen. Okay, while you do that, I really like the car wash um, things that have a little fringes on them, little finger ones. So I'm gonna try making us one of those. And what I've done is I've taken a pencil and a strip of fabric that was just an old piece of fabric we had laying around and I made a fringe. So I'm gonna start, you have to get your grown ups to help you with this part, with a little bit of hot glue. And I'm gonna glue the end onto here, onto this pencil. And then I'm just gonna wrap it around and we're gonna have one of those cool extra things in our car wash to clean all your toy cars. So we're just gonna roll that up 
Oh, good job with the sponges. And I'm gonna try not to get this twisted. Oh yeah, that looks really good. Do you wanna get a piece of tape and tape that into the doorway? I think this would easily be a project that your kids could do at home. If you give them some supplies, they could find all sorts of cool and interesting ways to make a car wash that we as grown-ups probably wouldn't even think about. And then we're just gonna hot glue this other edge. Again, this is the part that the grown-ups have to help with. And we've got this really, really cool spinner. Now, this is why we made these holes in our car wash walls a little earlier. So we're just gonna put one, actually we're gonna do this side first. We're gonna tuck this right through that hole in the cardboard and tuck this side up through the other hole. Now you won't be able to see this portion of the car wash when we put the other um, sponges on the door. So I'll show you right now. But I think that should work pretty well. How's it coming, Owen? You ready to tape the other ones in? Looks good. Do you want a hand? Yes. Okay. Here, stick one more on. And then I'm going to let you hold this. And I'm going to lift this up and you're going to spin it around and tape it to this door. Oops, one fell off. That's okay. I don't know how to tape it on, though. Okay. She's like that. Do you want to help? Yes. Okay. So I'm going to tape this right on the inside of the door, just like oh, that. Oh, on the inside? Yeah. Well, we could tape it on the outside. Should we tape this one to the outside? Sure. Okay, we could go on the outside too. We might need some more tape. Do you want to get some more tape? That would work. Let's tape it all the way around, the whole thing. Can you tape a big piece? Oh, yeah, that that's perfect. Yep. Yeah. Here, can you help me? You hold that side. Let's unroll the tape. Okay, ready? That's good enough. It doesn't matter if it's a little crinkled. So pull it all the way around. Yep. Perfect. Okay, now we're gonna take a break and get a waterproof bucket so that we can test out our car wash. Did I go get it? Okay, Owen and I have the car wash set up. Um, he's gonna start to soap up the vehicles. Um, he's using, um, what is that one? A paintbrush? Yeah. You could use a toothbrush or a paintbrush. And we're using some shaving cream that's really old and not very foamy anymore. Um, but you could use any type of soap that you have in your house and you can get your cars really, really clean. And then he's gonna push it through the car wash. Now, it's great if you have a Rubbermaid bin. We unfortunately had none that weren't full of things. And so we are using a laundry basket. So use whatever you have to kind of contain the mess. Oh, here it comes. And then, we have the power of the spray bottle to clean it at the end, to get it all nice and tidy. Oh, and do you want a spray? Yes. You wanna use the spray bottle? All right. Look at how clean it came out of there. That's the cleanest your car's ever been. So experiment with making your own toy car washes or um, toy washes at home. Show us your photos and videos. Have a great day, everyone.